This is authoritarianism calling itself liberal, calling itself conservative. And then you see J.C. Penney with a good-looking teapot a few months ago. It looks nice. It's like looking at a cloud and saying, I see Hitler. It's got a handle where it's supposed to be. It's got a top, a round top. It's silver. Let's put, let's start rolling some of this footage for people that are watching on PrisonPlanet.tv. Here is the evil. Here is the evil, evil, evil teapot. We're going to show the teapot first. Yes, there's the teapot that they say is so horrible and that is so evil. And then going back to the piece that I put together with Rob Dew, there is the evil teapot, and then there is my French bulldog. Now, I could have probably seen Hitler in, in, in a pile of dirt outside my house, but instead I started looking at Captain, our French bulldog, and I got to admit it, I'm like a closet Nazi because I kiss him right on his Hitler mustache. That dog gets kisses from me, okay? And for my children, they're, they're, they're sitting supporting Hitler. And look at him. I mean, he even looks like Hitler. His eyes kind of look like Hitler. He's got no fur on his lip, and it, so it looks like a Hitler mustache. That dog, J.C. Penney's, banned those teapots and had them destroyed. So I'm taking Captain today into the pound, and I'm going to have him put him in a gas chamber and kill him like they do stray dogs. And I'm sad, but I'm going to prove that I'm not racist, and I'm going to sacrifice him on the ultra-political correctness to prove I'm not racist and to satisfy Al Sharpton. So, Captain, should I give him lethal injection or, or give him the, 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 the pressure chamber? I mean, I don't want him to feel any pain. I love the dog. But, I mean, he does look like Hitler. And I realize I want to apologize. Maybe I should be gassed because I just realized I, my, my wife and I chose a dog when he was a puppy that had a Hitler mustache because of a subconscious racism. Can we, can we put the racism back up on air only to illustrate it and to apologize? Ladies and gentlemen, I want to apologize. Can we show my racist dog before we added the, the Iron Cross and the helmet, uh, the Kaiser helmet, the World War I uh, Field Marshal helmet? I mean, look at him, folks. That <laughs> I'm so ashamed that my dog is Hitler. <laughs> In fact, it may be a genetic experiment. He may actually be Adolf Alois Hitler. Perhaps he escaped to America and is hiding out not Argentina. No, that was they were all hiding at the CIA as a French bulldog. Ladies and gentlemen, even the, the uh, dog tag around his neck is of a bone. The Nazi skull and crossbones had a skull above a bone. Oh, my gosh, he is wearing a Nazi necklace. Gee, folks, this is just as bad as the teapot. Look at that little that that little bronze pill. That's 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 a that's a death's head, too. Well, thank God J.C. Penney banned that and. And, and you know what? I, I'm going to call the ADL and the Poverty Law Center and ask their advice. Should I euthanize Captain? Folks, I, I'm, I'm joking. I'm not serious. I'm illustrating absurdity by being absurd. I love Captain, and, uh, and I love him a lot. Uh, he does get kisses. I had an idea. I said, I bet if you know, making a joke about the J.C. Penney teapot, which obviously looks nothing like Hitler and wasn't meant to be Hitler, I mean, it is insane that my French bulldog uh, looks like he has a Hitler mustache because he doesn't have any fur on his upper lip, and he's got black skin, he's got black spots on him, there's a black spot right there, that are there other racist animals that need to be taken to be uh, gotten rid of like the teapots? And uh, we did find some. If you type in Hitler animals or Hitler dog, we found a baby English bulldog, very racist, Heiling Hitler. Not only does its nose look like a Hitler mustache, look at the hate in the eyes, uh, the dog has been trained to raise its arm, and I mean, look, Alert Al Sharpton immediately. And there's cats. Look at that cat right there. It's got a little bit of black on its nose. It's got black on its head that makes it look like Hitler. Adolf Hitler. Look at, uh, I've seen boxers, too, out that look a little bit like Hitler. And I'm going to walk over. And I'm going to say, hey, you need to be sent for re-education because we all know that you are basically in league uh, with Hitler. And, and, you know, I consider and joke about this, folks. It tears my heart out to know how conscious this authoritarianism is and how they get us all obsessed with imaginary stuff. Well, meanwhile, we're all losing our Bill of Rights and Constitution, our basic freedom.